Hey, greetings, everyone. This is Mike Jones. You know, as a lifestyle educator, I'm always, you know, teaching people how to live a healthier lifestyle and kind of find out, like, what foods will work for them. And I get this question. This is one that always pops up is, oh, I, I want to do, like, the vegan vegetarian thing, you know. So, I mean, can I do it? And first I have to say, you know, it's not just a, a thing, <laughs> you know, it's a, it's a way of life. You have to say the vegan vegetarian way of eating also, you know, spills over into your lifestyle. So again, like I always educate people on, it's not a diet, it's a lifestyle. So I just want to, you know, briefly kind of go over some benefits of, you know, having a primarily um, vegan diet. And again, you know, vegan means like you can't eat any meat, <laughs> no meats. Um, it's going to be primarily fruits, vegetables, grains, nuts, and seeds. And you'd be surprised how much variety you can have just with this, you know, with a, a vegan diet. And again, um, there's a lot of benefits to, again, eating a mostly plant-based diet. Um, it's going to be going to help kind of, you know, lower your risk of any kind of disease, if not prevent any kind of illness, you know, it's going to help you um, if you're having any issues with weight management, it's going to help, help you to lose weight and also to maintain it. It's going to, and also a big one that's hitting America's really hard is type 2 diabetes. You don't even have to worry about that with the vegan diet because again, you're gaining whole foods, nutrient dense, nutrient rich foods. So it's not something you're gonna to have to worry about along with heart disease and even some forms of cancer. Because again, we're seeing a lot of correlation between these disease and the way we eat and then the way we live life. Again, that's why I'm all about lifestyle management, okay? And, but there's also things that you still can't eat, you know, when I'm having, adopting a vegan lifestyle, you can still eat your pastas, you can still eat breads, you can still like, you know, some eat some little fried or sugary foods, you know, just as long as they're not made with like any eggs or dairy. And thank God there's so many like um, things that we have nowadays, like, you know, pastas made like, you know, with brown rice, you know, so there's a lot of alternatives 